but over the years the cooperation between india and france has deepened on multiple levels and one particular arena which has seen a much faster growth is of course the defense from submarines to uh, fighter jets to missiles there has been a larger cooperation and i have with me the uh, the french envoy to india to talk to us about where is this cooperation really headed so the question is where is this headed especially in the defense sector well it's not a surprise because when you uh, want to uh, have this sort of cooperation you need an exceptional level of trust between two countries because you have to to commit for 10 20 30 years you have to share the best and the finest technologies so you need uh, to be to be sure that there's a perfect understanding between two countries and the values are shared uh, that we have a vision of democracy, of rule of law, and we are aligned for years after years. And, and that's the value of our strategic partnership. We are celebrating the 25th anniversary of it. So now, in terms of uh, defense equipment, what do we want to do? I mean, obviously, we want to be uh, to have our strategic economy. We want to have our national uh, industry and industrial base. Uh, and uh, where are we going? Uh, uh, we, we started from a uh, a uh, situation where uh, France was transferring technologies, more technology than any other country to India, and, and even the, the, the rapid pace of development of India, the great number of the engineer, of his R&D, we are more and more, and it's very positive in a situation where our countries can not only co-produce, but also co-develop the equipment of the future. And we are very, we are very uh, satisfied with, with this. We are fully compliant with the uh, uh, with Indian government also vision of Marnia Barbarat. We think uh, we can make a great job with our industries together in that frame. You know, Prophet, you talked about co-development. You know, one of the co-development project is the jet engine technology. Uh, how soon do we think, do you think that this is possible? You know, we're talking about AMCA, the next generation fighter jet, jet engine technology. But we, as, as you know, we have uh, great industries, uh, manufacturing, developing uh, uh, jet engines, and uh, we are fully ready to be part of, uh, of this development. Replying to a query by the print during a brief media interaction, French envoy to India, Emmanuel Renin said, France is a great option for India to diversify its defense supplies amid a heavy dependence on Russia, and said his country is willing to partner with India on critical projects including possible nuclear-powered submarines. The print is uh, uh, a from the print. Uh, you know, you, you rightly mentioned that uh, France has been supporting India right from the very beginning during the sanctions hit uh, the nuclear test. Uh, India has been heavily dependent on Russia for its defense preparedness for right from submarines to aircraft to other systems. Uh, would the French be able to replace Russia when it comes to cooperation in the defense sector? Is this something that you're looking at? But obviously, we have a great uh, cooperation on, uh, on strategic issues uh, with your country, with India, and there's a great level of trust, the sort of trust that makes it possible for, for countries to commit over years, over decades, and, and to launch successful uh, defense equipment program. So that is for sure. And we, 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 we have seen many in the, in the last years. We've seen, uh, obviously, the, the successful delivery of the 36 uh, Rafale for the Air Force and we, we've seen many others. And uh, I must stress that uh, no other country can is so much committed to uh, uh, making available to Indian forces the best technology without restrictions and, and so much able to uh, not only to go to, uh, to do make in India but uh, also to, uh, to go further to uh, co-develop and co-produce uh, equipment. I think we, uh, our, lead, our governments at the top level have really understood the, uh, uh, the vision of Admanir Barbarat and, and they are really want to be partner in that process to build uh, a national uh, industrial basis for, for defense industries in India. I mean, we, we understand that also because we are a highly independent country and we've been through uh, that uh, process also. Uh, that being said, I mean, the, uh, it's, uh, 
it's good that we that we do. I mean, uh, India uh, is looking to uh, diversify uh, its uh, suppliers, and uh, obviously, uh, uh, I think that France is a great, great option, and we're working on the, on major uh, equipment cooperation together. Yes. So when the U.S. came in, office happened. Uh, India, uh, you, you've uh, already there are six submarines under construction, conventional submarines with India. You don't operate conventional submarines, all your submarines are nuclear. Is a nuclear submarine an area that you would like to partner with India? Because India relies a lot on Russia when it comes to development of the nuclear submarine program. Is this something that you're looking at, a nuclear submarine program with India? Well, as you know, we have a great uh, long-standing uh, cooperation on, uh, on submarines with, uh, with India. Uh, Naval Group uh, has, been, uh, has been partnering for, for years now with uh, uh, Mazagon Dock Limited in, in Mumbai. They've been building uh, and fully transferring the, the technology for, for six uh, Scorpion submarines. Uh, number five and number six are almost uh, number five at sea and number six uh, close to that. So it's great cooperation. Now, uh, as you know, we, um, we want to continue the partnership. I mean, uh, whatever the, uh, uh, India uh, will go for P-75I or a repeat order of P-75. Um, then for, for, for the next generation and things, uh, it's really uh, up to India to, to make its, uh, its mind on the technology, the solution it wants. Right now, I'm not aware of anything. Well, there you go. That was the ambassador talking to us the future of the bilateral cooperation between India and France when it comes to the defense sector. And particularly, the focus is on possible co-development. This is Nisha Alex Philip with video journalist Sham signing off from the French nuclear part aircraft carrier Charles de Gaulle here in Europe.